Greetings sports enthusiasts and welcome to our channel. If you are yet to do so, kindly hit the subscribe button to stay updated with our content. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest and most compelling stories from the world of sports and subscribing ensures you never miss a beat. Today, we turn our focus to a remarkable organization that stands at the intersection of sport and service, the Invictus Games Foundation. This organization, established by Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex, uses the power of sport to inspire recovery, support rehabilitation, and generate a wider understanding and respect for those who serve their country. Recently, the foundation made headlines with a historic visit to Ukraine, a proud member of the Invictus community of nations since 2017. Intrigued? We thought you might be. Now let's delve into the Invictus Games Foundation's recent historic visit to Ukraine. In a momentous occasion, the Invictus Games Foundation made its inaugural official visit to Ukraine. This isn't just any ordinary visit. It's a historic event that marks a significant milestone in the relationship between the Invictus community of nations and Ukraine, a proud member since 2017. As the Invictus Games Foundation delegation touched down on Ukrainian soil, they were met with an outpouring of warmth and enthusiasm. The Ukrainian hosts, in their characteristic spirit of hospitality, expressed their delight in welcoming the Foundation's representatives to their vibrant country. The air was charged with a sense of camaraderie that transcended borders and cultures. This wasn't just a visit, it was a celebration of shared values and mutual respect. Being a part of the Invictus community of nations for seven years now, Ukraine has consistently shown its commitment to the ideals of the Invictus Games. This visit was a testament to that commitment and a recognition of Ukraine's place in the Invictus family. It was an affirmation of the strong bonds of friendship and solidarity that exist between the nations. However, this was not just a diplomatic tour. It was a unique opportunity for the Invictus Games representatives to engage directly with the very people they've been supporting and cheering on from afar. They had the chance to experience firsthand the indomitable spirit of the Ukrainian people, their resilience and their unwavering dedication to the cause, despite the formidable challenges they face. This visit was not just a diplomatic tour, but it also offered a unique opportunity for the Invictus Games representatives. They were able to witness firsthand the strength and determination of the Ukrainian national team, who despite the ongoing war in their homeland, remained committed to their training and readiness for the upcoming games. Their perseverance serves as a beacon of hope and a testament to the human spirit. Their story is one that deserves to be heard, and the Invictus Games Foundation is proud to give them a platform to share it. During this landmark visit, representatives from the Invictus Games had the opportunity to engage directly with the Ukrainian national team. It was an encounter that was both inspiring and enlightening. The Ukrainian national team's dedication to the Games was evident from the minute the Invictus Games representatives set foot on Ukrainian soil. The team, composed of formidable athletes, each with their unique story of resilience, welcomed their guests with a spirit of camaraderie that transcended language and cultural barriers. The representatives had the chance to witness firsthand the team's rigorous training regimen. Despite the ongoing conflict in their homeland, these athletes were not deterred. Their daily schedules were filled with intense physical conditioning, tactical drills, and strategic planning sessions. The level of commitment shown by each athlete to not only their individual performance, but also to the success of their team, was truly commendable. The team's preparations for the upcoming event were nothing short of impressive. With each passing day, they're pushing their limits, honing their skills, and strengthening their resolve. They are leaving no stone unturned in their quest for glory on the international stage. They're not just training to compete, they are training to win. Yet it was not just the physical preparations that left an impression. The mental resilience shown by these athletes was equally noteworthy. Amid the backdrop of an ongoing war, they have managed to maintain focus, determination and a sense of purpose. They have channeled their personal experiences into a force of motivation, using them as a source of strength rather than a hindrance. Beyond the physical prowess and the mental toughness, what stood out most was their indomitable spirit. Despite the challenges, they remain steadfast in their commitment to represent their country with pride. They're not just athletes. They're ambassadors of their nation's resilience, courage and unwavering spirit. 
The team's unwavering dedication to training and readiness was awe-inspiring, to say the least. As they gear up for the upcoming event, they carry with them the hopes and dreams of an entire nation, ready to make their mark in the annals of the Invictus Games. The visit had a profound impact, not only on the Ukrainian national team but also on the Invictus Games Foundation. The visit was akin to bringing a magnifying glass to the intricate tapestry of challenges faced by the Ukrainian team, allowing the Foundation to gain a deeper understanding of the adversities they bravely confront. The ongoing conflict in Ukraine is not a distant, abstract concept, but a tangible reality that shapes the daily lives of these athletes. Their resilience, their unwavering commitment to training, and their readiness to compete against all odds. These are the qualities that make them true Invictus athletes. Against the backdrop of their homeland strife, the Ukrainian team's indomitable spirit was on full display. It was a humbling reminder of the transformative power of sport, its capacity to inspire hope, foster unity, and engender strength in the face of adversity. The resilience of these athletes served as a beacon, illuminating the path for others to follow. The Invictus Games Foundation, in turn, took away valuable insights from the visit. The experience underscored the urgent need to continue supporting nations like Ukraine, where the war has left its mark not only on the landscape, but also on the people. The Foundation has always been an advocate for the transformative power of sports, and this visit reaffirmed its commitment to this cause. Moreover, this visit has the potential to influence future games. The Foundation's understanding of the unique challenges faced by the Ukrainian team could inform the development of more inclusive and supportive policies. Such considerations could include providing additional support for teams from conflict-affected nations or tailoring training programs to account for the unique psychological and physical challenges these athletes face. This visit undoubtedly strengthened the bond between the Invictus Games Foundation and Ukraine, paving the way for future collaborations. The Foundation's commitment to the Ukrainian team's journey is unwavering, and this visit has only cemented the bond. In the words of the Invictus Games motto, they are truly unconquered. This historic visit by the Invictus Games Foundation to Ukraine signifies a new chapter in their relationship. A chapter that is not just penned with words, but etched with the resilience, camaraderie and indomitable spirit of the Ukrainian national team. A team that, despite the adversities posed by the ongoing war, continues to train with an unwavering commitment, embodying the Invictus spirit, unconquered and undefeatable. This visit wasn't just a diplomatic gesture, but a testament to the Invictus Games Foundation's commitment to its global community. It served as a beacon of hope and unity, shining brightly amidst the dark clouds of conflict. Ukraine, a proud member of the Invictus Community of Nations since 2017, welcomed the Foundation's delegation with open arms and hearts filled with gratitude. The memories of the visit, the laughter shared, the stories told, the dreams discussed, they all serve to underscore the immense potential of this relationship. The interaction between the Foundation and the Ukrainian national team was not just a meeting, but an exchange of ideas, experiences and aspirations. This visit has provided valuable insights into the team's preparations for the upcoming event, which will undoubtedly influence the future direction of the Invictus Games. The impact of this visit extends beyond the borders of Ukraine, it reverberates across the global Invictus community, inspiring athletes and nations alike. The story of the Ukrainian national team, their tenacity in the face of adversity, their spirit of resilience, their unwavering commitment to the Games, all serve as a powerful narrative that will continue to inspire and motivate. As we look to the future, we can expect to see the fruits of this visit ripen. The insights gained, the bonds formed, the stories shared, all will contribute to shaping the Invictus Games. We can look forward to witnessing the Ukrainian national team bring their spirit of resilience and camaraderie to the world stage, demonstrating once again that they are truly Invictus. In conclusion, the historic visit by the Invictus Games Foundation to Ukraine is not just a milestone in their relationship, but a stepping stone towards a brighter future. A future where the spirit of sport transcends boundaries, unites nations and inspires millions. As we wrap up, we would like to express our gratitude for your time. We hope that this story has not only informed, but also inspired. 
If you believe in the power of sport, in the spirit of resilience, in the ability to rise above adversity, then join us. Be a part of the Invictus community. Remember to subscribe, like and share our content. Let's spread the word. Let's spread the spirit of Invictus. Until next time, goodbye.